Alright, okay, hello everyone, and welcome back to our lap board. See, like 18.15, what? How are the mines? What? Where are my characters level 33? Well, uh, 32, I mean. Well, I kind of did some things in between. So, last time we were actually ended at the Boral uh, Castle. Let's, um. Let's move, up, let's move it up a notch and let's actually get what we need. So, I've been having a little conversation with Dragonstone, with the developer. And he told me, he gave me like a couple of small hints like where the plushies are. And I actually found them. It still took me like two hours as you saw earlier. Or at least today. So, today we had to look for... Oh wait. Do we didn't have to look for a flower. Where's to the right of there? Why is there a card there? Why on the other side is neither? Well... Because you can actually walk it. This is something I didn't realize at first. And something I really is pretty realized pretty later on. And it's there. The Dragon Plushie. On the other side, there should not be a door, by the way. But there is not. So yeah, that's uh, that one. I now want to say she switched to Ariel. And uh, let's get the other dragon plushie. Because I actually kind of know where that one is now as well. I literally looked for both of them. And boy, it was needed. That honestly was pretty hard. I was only like, like these two are like the most fair. Like these, these two are not the most fair ones. Like they're a lot more fair than what we've encountered in the past. But I can still remember one, and then I'm talking about the uh, the library one was actually pretty fair as well because you actually saw something happening that led to that. Um, but the other one, the um, the desert one, that you had to follow between these rocks, the rocks that weren't even on your screen. That was an unfair one. Still, we got it thanks to um, help, like the Steam uh, post about it, because someone was actually raging uh, to drag some about it eventually, in, like the Steam. So. I kind of found it that way. <laughs> so I'm going to actually get some points out. Also, we're going to go back to Borough in a second because I just want to show something. And this is something actually pretty fun that I found out. Because you can actually glitch your way into the battle version of Borough. And I know it's super times, but it actually, it's actually true. It actually works. I've had this yesterday and like, it worked out. Okay, let's get something. Um, just attack that one. Attack that one. So the thing with this is I need to actually keep up more like my healing. If you don't do that, uh, you won't actually get anyone here.
Beautiful. That's something I really like about this patch. The fact that I'm using it in like, the right way. Uh, you can just one-shot an enemy. Which is kind of what I've been doing, of course. Hmm? Oh, that's where I came from. No. No. I'm messing up now. I'm actually going backwards to myself, but I should not do that. Oh, God damn it! Well... But it's going to hurt the both of them. We already have some damage on us, so... I kind of would like to see, keep up a lot of my healing. And I normally dispatch the bottom one. Because I normally focus all my fire on like, the top one. In this, uh, in the lower one has like bigger combo, so it has more of like a wharf to actually attack the bottom one at that point. I kind of wonder though, like, we're going to go into two fights. Very soon. How is this all going to happen? How are we going to actually do those boss fights? Like, we only have one healer. We, like, if we get into, like, bad status effects, I can't do it this way. I can't actually heal with just that. Because remember, status effects was Duncan. What do we not have? Duncan. So how am I supposed to be able to do this? Because just stay select items aren't going to cut it if, if the enemy is going to heal itself as well. Also, like, in my last position and, like, the game isn't really correct. Like, on screen, like, one is not here, but it's... One is, like, lower. Yeah, I don't know how to do that. Also, nobody's any for play with mouse, so... There we go, dispatch. I mostly play this game with my keyboard anyway. Only the fights I tend to actually do with mouse, but I can, I can switch it around for like this session still. Oh, so candle. Remember, take the we need to take the fastest route here. I don't want to actually get attacked a lot, so Ah oh, fuck my life. Yes, the depth area actually is encountered in three areas. We've just surpassed the first area. Once we go to like the gate that is up there, uh, we're through the first area. And so please still control well. Okay, good, and we can actually heal in um, in city as well. Okay. 
gonna have to at this point. So this is why I need to keep up on my healing, because I don't know what is going to happen soon. I don't know what is going to happen when it gets to um, the enemies not getting. So why did I do it that way? Because I know uh, Druk is going to just use a bit like the bottom one. Sure. What is that? Oh no. Please get rid of that one. So this bigger healer is actually down. I oh, fuck my life. I know that drug does like a lot of damage, so I'm like, yeah, but don't usually put him on attack duty when I get to that. I don't put him on like attack duty of like a lot of the enemies that point. Color arms it's broken. That's what I wanted. That's what I wanted to do earlier when they would feel like three left. And that's just what I feel to do. So we've gone out through 15 minutes of just this to get like to two, to two of the um, the plushies. Just before I go to um, our life castle, I will actually save again. So this is like the second area. It's only because I was here like last session as well. And this is like the third area, the one that we're going into right now. It isn't here. I know it's it's just after like uh, way up again. Just after a ladder. It's it, we're very we're very close at this point. It's just this fight that we're practically there. I don't suppose we're actually going to get like yet another fight after this. Then, one more thing, we can do this. Uh. Is I mean, healing isn't really required, it's just better if we heal now. And then that we rank up a lot of damage that we can't do anything afterwards. Thank you, Dragon Zone, for the house. How are you doing? Uh, I can't do this match. I actually started spamming dispatch whenever I can summon the monsters. We are. Oh, sure. I'll just do normal attacks now. Welcome to the live stream! Uh, I think because the. EMP is capital item, that's why it didn't work. How are you doing? Let me give you the shout out. Actually, I'm zero miles right now. Um, yeah, here. I always look at like the health of the characters because if the health is um, dropped down even a little bit at this point, I just heal. Because sometimes they're, uh, like, the, the amount of attacks on them, like the... Oh, I need to actually find one of It's like... The blue bar here. It, it kind of scares me, actually. Oh, not the blue bar. The little bar above it, like the, the yellow-red bar. 
it just scares me to to see like how far it goes and like sometimes healing is the better. Especially if that happens to the healer, then I'm fucked. Please don't touch for it. Nope. Okay, sure. That works as well. Okay, level 32. So, about that last plushie. Wait a second. It's further to the left. You just go down. Ah, there's the ledge. There we go. Let's say she stepped out of there. And then I think... No, it's not this one. Uh, it is... Okay, let me first save before I do anything. I need to very quickly remember which of the buildings it was. Oh, wait a second. I was actually going to show, like, the, the little glitch as well. So the glitch is actually very simple. It, it's it's not the hardest. And back in back in here. So you can see it right now. You can just walk here. Uh, by the way, uh, there is a chest in here that you normally uh, can't get to, and if you go here, you have to shift out officially. Because otherwise, this happens. I just keep walking to the right, and I'm just in the water here now. Yeah, you can't go into that building when it's like when like uh, the whole thing happens with mail or something. I don't know what his name was. Yeah, now you go up here. You can actually glitch onto this side, and you just go here. Wait, what? It's not working this time. Oh, I think you have to get to that two times. Because I know I did it two times when I did it, so. Or not? Okay. Hmm. For sure, yesterday go back to like the, the fighting part. I can't reproduce it this time. Sure, I accept. It's red though, like I was able to reproduce it earlier. Oh. And if I then go to the north, I just get this. <laughs> um. Yeah, so I just, uh, actually it just said Archimoto locked the collector. So I do officially now have the, um, the achievements as well. Should show up in a second. There we go. Uh, loads and then just... Turn. So which building was it? Could have been this one. Oh, uh, nope. This is the only thing I always forget, like, which building it was for this. I think it was this one, now. Uh, 
No, it's definitely this one because of the stack is here. I should not to screenshot this. Like, why not? I didn't. I didn't, but I, I knew like where it was. Welcome to the developer's room. By now you'll have to understand that this world is not quite what it seems. Please, go and face your final challenge. This is like the first time I've actually entered this room. Oh my. We got all on the adventure, hope you enjoyed the sound of it. Oh wow. Cats are cute, but they're assholes. Don't trust the cat. What? No, no, the master drew. The rest of them already is fake. Well then. Yeah, I never went in before. Uh I'm assuming actually doing the right effect. Is this where the real challenge is? Let me first just talk. No we is... It is great, it's kind of like a re vacation. That's a very positive attitude actually. I know a plus one where you can cancel. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh god. I kinda actually expected this to happen. Peace in Kevin. So you found the developers then, congratulations. And now I have one final chance to present to you. You have to defeat my inner dragon. I must warn you immediately, I'm a spectacular challenge. Give up by yourself, I'll be waiting for you. Um This is the bottom one. You should find a warning, the next time we speak, be ready for a particular battle, unlike any you've encountered before. Uh, I guess there's nothing more to say. Best of luck to you, player. You'll need it. Let's do this. Ooh. Wait, you have a countdown? It easily gave a countdown on the top. Also, truck is immediately half health. Um... Okay, so you also have this thing where you, um... Uh, what is it called again? What is it called again? Like the... Um, you hit back if you get attacked. Like you have a chance to hit back, so it's good to know. We instantly need to recover for this. She instantly almost down as well there. So Kiara now starts normal attacking. Oh, um, okay. <laughs> I was not prepared. My god. So save my mouse isn't really oh my mouse isn't right now, okay, sure. It only cost me like a restart. Um Sure. 
I'm, I'm going to lose this. I am not. I was not prepared for this. But there was like almost 3000 damage. Oh no. Oh no. Uh. Yeah, we can just heal. Get at something. But these are all back up to full health now. That is one step of the way. Mm, I can't do anything else. I have to attack. I mean, I could also just have blocked like the incoming attacks, but that would not have done anything. Um... That's right, almost done. We're almost there creating um, the Awoken Dragon to... At least getting into like the, um, the Lost Tailors. I'm gonna have to call it again. I forgot again. Oh god. So let's gear our down. Uh, this means we need a soul candle, which I don't have enough of. It's gonna be painful. I also did it the wrong way around. Just recover now. We have to do this. Okay, sure. That's the first step. I'm just going to rank this up right now. Okay, whatever I do, actually, if I do just an item, like a bandage or um, any, for instance. I come out just before he attacks. Which gives me yet another strike to rank up a little bit of damage. Okay, doesn't matter. 58 combo. Yet, that was not enough. That wasn't even enough to, like, do a complete line of damage. Jesus. Uh, ointment. Because I don't want the healer to die. You don't do enough blades. I 
Doesn't really matter. Eight is still something. Oh no. Uh, wasn't gone. Oh no. Rip. Oh, that's a nostril candle. I think I'm actually not going to survive with this one. I think things will not uh, go the way I expected them to go. That's okay. As long as he doesn't duck Kiel, I'm okay. Ah, oh, fuck my life. Um... <laughs> Hope I saw the world. The endless night just blows you. Will I hear a rise again? <laughs> um... Sure. Oh, okay. Um... I was right on staying up on the healing the entire time. I was right to focus on that. Make sure that he doesn't lose any more health. Oh, for the love of God. So, how did battle originally start? Went a lot better than how it's going right now. Um. But that's an attack I can manage. That's something I can deal with. 